Welcome back to another episode of 52 Puzzles. Today I bring you another cool puzzle. This one is called the Snake Puzzle and it's a 3x3x3 three by three by three snake puzzle, meaning there are 27 individual cubes. They're all connected together and the goal is to twist them such that you make a three by three by three cube from these 27 pieces. Well, it seems like it should be relatively simple to do that. They all twist individually, mostly in all directions. Uh, but I will tell you, if you're not familiar with snake puzzles, a good solution time on this puzzle is one hour. They are not easy puzzles to solve if you're not familiar with, with the particular twist pattern. Which, by the way, many of these snake puzzles are made uh, using wood, like this one. This one is coming from my favorite craft shop in Florida called Creative Craft House. And so the snake puzzles may look similar, the 3x3x3 three by three by three snake puzzles. However, many have different twist patterns. So it makes snake puzzles very collectible for that reason. And uh, there I have friends that are puzzlers that uh, have elaborate collections of, of snake puzzles. I also have a 64 block snake puzzle, which you're trying to create a four by four by four cube. That's an extremely difficult puzzle and I'll show that to you in a future video. But this one, again, is 27 cubes, and I'm going to show you the solution to this particular puzzle. As always, if you don't want to see the solution, I encourage you to uh, turn the video off now. I thank you for watching. However, if you do want to see the solution, here it comes. So the first step to solving the puzzle is to first stretch the pieces out so they lay flat like you see here, so you can see what you're dealing with. And for this particular puzzle, again, snake puzzles have different twist patterns, but this particular one, what I'm looking for to get started is this end of the puzzle. I'm looking for these three pieces, the dark, light, dark, next to a light and dark. And the very first step to the puzzle is to actually twist this so that we make a base like you see here. That's the first step. Um, the rest of the puzzle here doesn't come into consideration until, until we move on in the solution. So I'm going to zoom the camera and just focus on the area, the front of the puzzle, which uh, is what I'm working on. Okay, so the first step here again was to uh, find those two pieces and, uh, and basically create that base. The next step is I'm going to take these three pieces and I'm going to twist it up to create a vertical column of three blocks going like this. So that is going to look like that. And then I want to make a second three block column next to it from these pieces. And the way I do that is I'm going to twist the snake here and then bring, bring those pieces down like you see there. Okay, so that is the next step to the puzzle. And then it's pretty easy from here. The next step is we're going to begin to take the rest of the snake and wrap it around the puzzle. So you'll see what I mean by that. So there is one. And then we're going to take this three block column and twist it. So that we now have uh, basically this situation. So you've got three, three, and then on the bottom, three and three. 
Uh, the next step is we're going to take these two cubes here. Hopefully you can see what I'm doing here. This is the darker cube, this is the lighter cube. And we're going to flip them to bring them next to this dark and this light cube. So that looks like this. Okay. And then the rest of the puzzle is very easy. We're going to take these three here and we're going to twist it so that they lay flat there. Uh, similarly, we're going to take these three and now twist those. So you can see we've finished that face. We've got the bottom face. We're almost done on this side. And the rest is simple. This piece twists like this. And then the very last piece is simply going to twist like that. Or I keep saying pieces, but they're it's all one piece, the last move. <laughs> so there is the solved snake puzzle. Pretty cool. This is a great uh, puzzle for all ages, really. Um, and it's a nice one because it's all one piece. So you don't risk losing any, uh, any of the pieces. There you have it, the snake puzzle. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please give me a thumbs up and please subscribe. I intend to give you, uh, bring you a new puzzle every week, hence the name 52 Puzzles. Thanks for watching. Until next time, keep on puzzling!